or a complete rest. The secret of putting the hoof blocks on is to get the foot really clean. So I, I just use the rasp and just clean every single wall. And also, the, the shoes come in three different sizes. So make sure you get the one big enough to go on the foot. You, know, you can do it with one of these or you can just get a, a surf form or something from the, the local DIY shop. The secret is to keep trying the hoof, the shoe, before. So as you can see ladies and gentlemen, these are all different sizes, sizes they're not yeah. all manufactured the same. Wrong. Have we got the other side? So the, yeah. Now, I just keep sliding it on while it's empty, but you imagine when you put it on, there's glue in there, so you need it to make it really slack. And at the moment, when I slide that back, it's just feel as though it's catching here in the toe. So what I'm going to do is just round that off a bit more there. And that goes on a lot. You want to make sure that the, the shoe comes far enough back. A lot of problem is if you don't shorten the foot to the right length or you don't get the, long, the right enough length block. Come on, go. Have you got an opposite, a smaller one opposite? Just to show the difference between the small and the... That's it. No, that's that one. See, that's not coming back far enough. So when she puts her foot on the floor, it might sit up like that. Whereas that one is coming right back and giving a real good support to the whole of the, the claw. Now once you've cleaned it off like that, I normally then just get the rasp and I would just get rid of these, get a hold of the knife, just get rid of any of these little bits of muck in there. But then I score the outside of the hoof to make it rough, to give the glue somewhere to knit. And then you mix the... The powder, this cow doesn't need it so I'm not going to put it on. Mix the powder and the liquid in there and I normally wait just for a few minutes just to let it to start to go off before I put it on the foot and then you know it doesn't all run out and everything. Um, <laughs> how, how long would you leave that on here? Would you leave it on until it was completely worn away or would it, is there some point when you'd say there? Let's it Ideally you need to leave it on four to six weeks. If it's on any longer than six weeks you start doing damage to this claw because she's carrying more weight on that one as she would but normally after about a month to six weeks the problem is healed um, again you, you, you pick it up and reassess the foot and if you feel you need to put a new one on or give it give it a take it off and give the, that claw a rest for a few weeks and uh, and then put a new one back on but nine times out of ten one one block it's amazing how quick the cow's foot will heal. And you refer into that dew claw, that one actually does need coming off. She's just got a bit of a loose. Okay, that's just simple. Any questions?